Hey, what's up everybody? So I made a video yesterday about some issues with the new 7.3 uh, firmware update for the Blackmagic cameras uh, and the Viltrox adapters. Uh, several comments, people you know, saying they experienced the same issues. I tried several things trying to roll back uh, the firmware on the adapter to, you know, multiple versions, nothing really worked. Um, and then I saw a couple of comments that made me think maybe there's a different trick to this uh, and that was working for some people with older versions or even with this adapter. So uh, what I tried was uh, re actually removing the lens while the camera was on instead of the adapter. The previous trick I used was to have the camera on and remove the adapter a couple of times until you could uh, you know, change the iris setting and that stopped working with the 7.3 update, so that's why I posted the video. Uh, but I've realized now that if I detach the lens from the adapter, sometimes three times, sometimes five times, one time it took eight times, but eventually I will get the iris to show up, uh, the iris, iris setting to show up so that uh, I can change the aperture of the lens from the camera. So I just want to make an extra video like this so that if anybody sees this and is searching for it, they'll find, you know, maybe this is a workaround until Viltrox can, you know, put out a 3.6 or whatever version that's going to, you know, work with this uh, new Blackmagic update. So anyway, I hope this helps. Uh, if you like this type of stuff, make sure you subscribe and give this video a like. Share it with anybody that you think are having the same issues uh, with this camera and this adapter. Uh, thanks for watching.